Hi there, this is Steve, and in this video we're going to learn how to multiply in Excel. And multiplication can be very simple in Excel, and I'll show you a couple of ways to do it, but it's a surprisingly common question that I get. So let's jump over into an example sheet here, and I'll show you how to do it. Okay, in this example we have in column B here, we have just the numbers 1 through 5, and then in column C we have the number 10 over and over. And I've made these simple so that we can do the math in our heads and then you'll be able to see how it works in Excel. So we know that 1 times 10 would be 10, and 2 times 10 would be 20, 3 times 10 would be 30, and so forth. So let's go ahead and put in some formulas so that you can make Excel do the work for you. So the first thing you want to do is click in your cell that's next to them where you want your answer to show up. And the first way to do it is to create a formula where you start with equals and you simply click on the first number and that puts your cell reference in there. And then in Excel, we don't use the X as a times, we use a star. So you hit a star or an asterisk is a better word for it. And then we're gonna select the cell that we wanna multiply by like that. And so we have cell B2 times cell C2. And that's all you have to do. You hit enter and you see that we get the result. Now another quick thing you can do is you can click on that cell and then you can copy your formula down just by double clicking. And that auto fills your formula down to all the other cells and you can see that these are all correct. So 4 times 10 is 40. 5 times 10 is 50. And if you click into the cells and look up in the formula bar here, you can see that the formulas all move down. Okay, now let's delete these and I want to show you another way to do some multiplication. Actually, let me right click and hit delete. And that's fine. So we get rid of those. Now another way that you could do this is to use the function for product, and product is the math term for multiplication. So you start by typing PRO, and you'll notice a list of functions comes up, and you can see product is right here. And you can either scroll down and select it and then hit tab. You can click on it, but you can also just hit tab, and notice it will load it right in there. And then you see it, this is our function arguments. It's asking us what do we want the product of. And of course we want the product of 1 and 10. So we just click that. And then we hit the comma to separate the two. And then we hit the second one. And then you can add the, the closed parentheses or you can just hit enter and Excel will do it for you. So I'm just going to hit enter. And you can see now when I select on that, instead of having B2 times C2, it's saying give me the product of B2 and C2. And again, if we take this and double click it or even grab it and drag it using the little black plus sign and release, then it'll copy our formula down. And now we're getting the product of these two columns which is the same as multiplication. But one of the most important things to remember is that when you're multiplying, you don't say 1x2. In Excel, you say 1 asterisk 2, and that's how you multiply. So I hope that helped you out. Thanks so much for watching. If you want to learn more, check on the links in the description. I have some full courses that are for beginners that will bring you all the way to mastery in Excel, and I'd love to see you in there. Like the channel if you like it, subscribe if you want to get more videos, and thanks for watching.